hi welcome to my channel and welcome to today's video facial mask anti-aging facial mask unique facial mask I'm actually talking about the facial mask that I'm gonna be sharing with you today I'm gonna to use a very special ingredient in this facial mask I'm gonna add a few other natural ingredients to this facial mask and this is gonna create an anti-aging tightening firming lifting moisturizing facial mask this facial mask is great for acne prone skin it is great for getting rid of large pores it's also great for tightening and firming the skin and guess what here comes the bonus this facial mask will also get rid of spots and blemishes on the skin it's gonna leave your skin just bright clear glowing firm tight when used on a regular so if you're looking to have your skin radiant glowing and younger looking also come with me to the kitchen and I'll show you how to whip this facial mask up in no time our first ingredient is charcoal and take a look at our charcoal now charcoal has many benefits it is great for whitening the teeth it's also good to get rid of toxin from the body both inside and outside it is great for shrinking large pores and is also when mixed with other ingredients is great for moisturizing the skin it helps to keep the skin clear bright soft and radiant our next ingredient is milk and this is coconut milk if you have regular milk go ahead and use it but today I'm using some coconut milk coconut milk is very moisturizing it is also great for plumping up the skin and when mixed with the charcoal it's gonna give a great anti-aging benefit to the skin now I'm gonna add an optional ingredient and this is the aloe vera gel aloe vera gel is gonna clear the skin from spots blemishes is great for sunburn is great for moisturizing the skin is great for getting rid of acne aloe vera gel is just a versatile ingredient to use on the skin now you don't need a lot of charcoal for this mix so I'm using just one tablespoon of charcoal one teaspoon of our aloe vera gel if you have fresh aloe vera gel it's just as good and I'm gonna start off with one teaspoon of our milk pour this in and now I'm just gonna slowly blend this in the charcoal so just take your time now if this is too watery you definitely is gonna add a little bit more of the charcoal since we're mixing this into a paste so just blend the three ingredients together just mix well now for me this is looking a little bit too watery so I'm gonna add a little bit more of the charcoal not a lot so I'm gonna add about a half a teaspoon more of charcoal and this is good now charcoal is very absorbing okay it is similar to fuller's art so when you add liquid to the charcoal it's just gonna soak it up and that is why the charcoal is great for tightening that skin it's a great ingredient to use as a skin tightener it's gonna lift that skin and firm that skin and along with the other ingredients which is beneficial to the skin it's basically make a perfect anti-aging charcoal mask so now our charcoal mask is ready and I'm gonna move on the other side and show you how to use this wonderful charcoal mask for a best result now here I have the anti-aging charcoal facial mask to apply this mask I suggest that you use a brush if you do not have a brush use a cotton ball or some cotton pads now you want to make sure to cleanse your skin before you apply so wash your face get rid of all the grease the dirt from your skin and then apply your facial mask now take a look at this it's a little thick so you just want to give it a stir just before you apply it to the skin and then you apply in upward strokes that's how I like to apply this facial mask it's further gonna help to lift and firm the skin now completely cover your entire face with the facial mask now a lot of people do not know how to make charcoal however 
when I was a kid growing up, they used to make charcoal. So what they would do, they would go and get the wood, which is normally green branches from trees, and they would dig a hole, like a very, very deep hole, which they would consider to be a pit. And then they would place the wood in piles in the hole. And, you know, they would um, pile the wood high above the hole, starting from in the hole to above the hole, above the ground, as if they're making a bonfire. Now, after doing that they would completely cover that wood with dirt so they would pour a lot of dirt as if they're making a dirt bank and then they would leave a little hole in there where they could actually you know light the wood i think they use kerosene or something like that to light the wood and after a while you'll notice that the smoke start to come through the 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 dirt and that they would leave i think for a day or two and then after they would go back when the smoke has totally diminished and then they would take some stick and then they would like just spread it out and there you find charcoal now they would leave it there for a couple more days for it to cool down and then they would bag it up and that's how i grew up seeing them making the charcoal now when i was growing up i didn't know that charcoal was good for the skin to be honest it's later on in life that i discovered that charcoal actually is great for the skin however i know that they did use charcoal for a lot of medicinal reason and also for cooking which was the main reason for making charcoal so that's a little history of you know the way they make charcoal back then i don't know about now since i think it's been manufactured on a larger scale okay guys so after applying this mask to your skin you're going to sit with it for at least 30 minutes now after 30 minutes you're going to rinse this off preferably with some warm water then you're going to pat dry the skin and then you're gonna spray with your favorite facial toner then you're gonna apply your facial serum and next your facial moisturizer okay now for storing just cover and store in your refrigerator for about seven days after seven days you make a fresh batch okay so just gonna relax with my facial mask for about 30 minutes okay guys i've been wearing this for 30 minutes give and take a few minutes and take a look touchable it is completely dried on the skin totally dry okay look at that it is dry so this is what is going to happen when you wear the mask it's going to dry on the skin and guess what yes it's going to be really tight on the skin you're going to feel the tightness on the skin feeling it just tightening and firming the skin okay so after 30 minutes now i'm going to rinse off and i will be back it's really and truly amazing so what you're gonna do next you're just gonna spread some facial toner on next you're gonna put a little facial serum and then your favorite moisturizer so i'm gonna go ahead and i'm gonna do just that for real for real for real for real for real so there you have it guess what guys you see for yourself so what are you waiting for go ahead and give this facial mask a try after you try it come back leave your comment and share it with your friends share it on your social media because it is really an amazing facial mask thank you all for watching and i'll see you in my next video bye bye